name of the gods are you doing here? How, how come you're in our kingdom? This is my father's <sighs> palace. Wow. You are the last person I expect to see here. Oh my God. Wow, Ada. Ah. Oh, pardon my manners. I'm sorry. It's okay. Mom, Onowu, um, elder of our land. Uh, this is my friend, Williams Okoye. Yeah. We were together on a business summit in Kenya, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. you're right. You're right. And that was the last time I saw you. Exactly. Oh my exactly. goodness, I'm so happy to see you. I'm so sorry, please sit. And nice to meet you too, Same Anna. here. Same. Oh, sorry, pardon my manners. Um, <laughs> before I say it, my address, I greet you. Queen Mother, I greet you, man. Yeah. Thank oh, you so much. Please sit. Ada. So what brought you to my kingdom? I mean, this is my village. This is my father's palace. From Naya. Yes. Do you know the guests? I don't know. His face is it's confusing. It's striking. I, I don't know. Maybe he's one of your father's friends. Maybe, yes. He said your face looked like someone he knows before. From somewhere. It looks like someone I met months ago in my, in my village. But he wasn't as wealthy as this one. I don't know, it's really confusing. <sighs> People can actually look alike. But girls, that guest is so handsome. I've never seen him in this palace before. Yes, he is handsome. You know what, my head is pounding. I, I, I just need to rest. I'll see you later. All right. What's happening? I don't just understand. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Let me go and continue what I'm doing in the kitchen. You're so beautiful. You're the most beautiful creature I've ever seen. I can't stop staring at you. My prince, why are you f flattering me? Why are you trying to drag a, a poor girl out? Why? You're trying to start something you cannot finish. Why do you want to do no, this to me? I am not flattering you. I am telling you the truth. And that's the reality. You know, I can't take my mind, I can't take my eyes off you. Come here. I want to tell you something. What? You're the choosing one. sleeping why would you sleep I don't I don't I don't blame you I don't blame you huh? why won't you sleep you will feed yourself destiny to sleep I want to hear nature I want to hear nature this is what it all oh I'm not going to sleep it's yours you are here sleeping oh I will fetch water and I'll be calling you and you don't answer me I will fetch water have you fresh fire? Have you cooked? Nothing. Are you here sleeping? Eh? I'm not here. I'm not here. I'm no man. I don't blame you. I'm a feeding my cost here. Idiot. I don't blame you. Onya, onya Allah. Let me see you here again. If you don't come back with firewood, eh? If you don't come back with firewood, don't come back to this house. Idiot. In 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 here here here. Come and sleep now. I'm a feeding my cost here. Don't come back. <laughs> no, no, no. What, 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 
is the meaning of this? Why are you laughing? What's funny? <laughs> I'm not laughing. <laughs> I'll never tell you anything about me again. So, sorry you know. now. I'm laughing for the fact you said that your auntie poured you cold water. I'm not laughing because of the dream. <laughs> yeah. Yes. She poured me a full bucket of water. No problem. <laughs> Is it funny? You and she put me what I ran away. I went back to church to go get the fair wish. She asked me to, to go get it. It's okay. Let's go. Jo. From Let's Naya, go. wait. You think about it. Let's check it. Is it not funny? She just put it. How was your reaction? It's funny now. Laugh with me, Jo. She says, good, Jo. You need to see the way I jumped up. So let's go. <laughs> Your dream is very sensitive. I know. <laughs> and you must not tell any of your friend, any of them, who be the new Madam Joe. All right? And none of your friends love you. And a prince? Yes, he was wearing a royal attire. Look, you, you said you helped this person fill up his radiator in the car. Just that. From now on, what is destined to be must surely be. Okay? More reason why I, I just want you to leave this house. If I want you to leave this house because I, I, I don't like the way things are going here. Mama and Kilichi might just wake up one day and kill you. And you know I'm not always around. Tizito, I need a job. I don't know how to get a job. I need a job. Please, don't you just help me. Help me, please. I, I need a job. about that from Naya. I am traveling to Izudo Kingdom tomorrow. When I get there, I will certainly try my best and make sure you secure a job. Okay? I promise I will do my best. Thank you. It's okay. It's okay. It's Thank okay. you, my brother. Please, don't tell anyone about this dream. <sighs> I would not. <laughs> Greetings, my princess. I, I am sorry. I, I didn't know you were actually passing this It's way. okay. I, you look new. Because I've not seen your face here before. My name is Fomnanyo Okonko. I was just employed as a majesty's maid. Uh, it's okay. It's okay. But why are you nervous? Are you alright? Is everything okay? Yes, my princess. I am okay. You sure? Yes. It's alright. Go on with your church. Thank you. Mm. So good to have you in the palace, Mr. William Sokoye. Thank you, ma'am. So, Williams, 
When are you returning to London? Williams. Yeah, I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> Forgive me. It's okay. I was asking when you were returning to London. Okay, immediately after the project. Oh, really? So, we are going to have you here for some time? Yeah. That sounds good. <laughs> I hope you're enjoying the food anyway. Oh, very well. I love it. <laughs> it's nice. That young man. I think I like him. I like him too. And there's something I noticed. What is it? I think he likes the princess, our daughter. But as usual, she's kicking off. You know her now. Your Highness, please speak to her. Please. Has it gone? Father, you need to talk to Martha. I don't like what she is doing. I don't like it. What have I done? <coughs> Did you ask Williams to propose to me? What? Did he propose to you? Yes, he did. And I turned him down. I... How dare you? That good man! Your Majesty. Can you see your daughter? Were you about to lay your hand on me? I would have slapped sense into your head if not that we are in your father's presence. What is wrong with you? do you think you are that you can you will say no to such a good man a place i need to sleep your majesty you have to do something i need to sleep <clears throat> <clears throat> She will have to remain like this because I'm sure she will come back. Okay. Huh? And then you will insist you're not leaving until I accept your proposal. Nice one. Nice Good one. one. I think she's coming. She's coming. She's coming. Um, Mr. Williams, good night. I don't know what you're doing. Uh, no. Really? Uh, uh, you're, I, I'm not leaving here until you accept my proposal. Until I accept. Uh, Mom. No, I greet you. I, I hope all is well. No, no, all is not well. All is not. I've seen someone that I want to marry. All I needed in a woman is here. Lola, I'm seeing a wife of my youth inside of her. But she's not seeing me as her husband. It's not right. Okay. And I'm not stepping an inch from this palace till she accepts my proposal. Very well then, Mr. Williams. The palace is big enough. There are rooms here. So you're welcome. Please. One of the maids will show you the guest room. Do have a good night rest. Princess, good night, mother. don't do this to Good me. night. And when Princess. you're done, you can stand up and Princess. go to bed. Excuse I am me. not leaving this palace. Ah. Mr. Williams. Hi. Lolo. Don't you think this is too early? Mm -mm. No, no, it's not too early. I've been into this gear for a long time. We've done business together. We've done a lot of things together. And I fell in love. Hey, no, no. I'm not stepping an inch till, till, till she accepts my proposal. What is this? This is, this is crazy. Yes, I, I, love, I love doing crazy things. Holy mother. Is it a crime to love princess? 
Ese está de cruel. Get up, get up, get up. Ponle la boca, ponle la boca, ponle la boca. Get up. Ay. What is this man still doing in this palace? I don't know. From now, are you okay? I am fine. Are you sure you're okay? I am fine. Dear Lord, if this man is proposing to our princess, let our princess never say no because this man is too handsome. Oh, what? Eric is handsome too. Eric is handsome too. Let me go and peep him again now. Hey, go and peep now. Peep, go and peep. You want to peep? I don't want to peep. Go now, go on. You said you want to peep. Go and peep. Go and peep. Peep her. Can this be the same man I encountered months ago? <sighs> My brother said, always believe in your dreams. But this dream, this dream is impossible. <sighs> I'm so confused right now. Really confused. <sighs> oh, you are here. Your Majesty wants to see you. I hope there's no problem. No, no, no. Come on, relax. There's no problem. She just wants to see you, that's all. There's no problem. Okay, let's go. Okay. My queen, yes, you sent for me. Ma. I did. We have a guest, so please prepare the guest room. The one downstairs, okay? As it pleases your majesty. Thank you. I know that girl. Yes, she's the one. She's the one. She's the one that gave me water that I bought inside my car. Yes. But what is she doing in this place? That girl. What will I do to repair her? She's a nice person. My instincts cannot lie to me. That's the girl, I'm sure. Is, is he the one? What? Is he a prince? He won't recognize me. Mm -hmm. so I am scared right now. I am so scared. My princess, you don't have to stay this for too long. Shh. Bring down your voice. I'm not shouting. This is getting creepy. And I'm scared. Sina, don't worry. I know what I am doing, okay? Bo, you know Chief Oji is planning to... Don't you think it is too early for me to accept? No, my princess. Go 
Greetings, Your Majesty. My dear, how are you? I'm fine, ma. Martha. My princess, we all know that your past still hurts. But oh, please let it go. Let it go, please. Give Mr. William Sokole the chance, please. Madam, I love. See, there is no need of closing your company or even closing your accounts or putting you through all the stress. Hmm? See, if you don't want to be the queen, you don't want to succeed your father, it's okay. <laughs> Anything that will make you happy, that's what we're going to do now. Nobody will force you, not I, not your father. Hmm? I'm sorry to have put you through that stress. Okay? It's okay. Please, my princess, I want to see you become a queen. Please. I will think about it. It's okay. Excuse me, mother. I'll see you later. It's okay. My dear. Ma. Thank you for being a good friend to my daughter. Thank you so much, ma. Please keep talking to her. All right, ma. Thank you so much. You're a very good friend. Mm. And I like you. Thank you, ma. Thank you. What was that? What were you discussing with her? Okoye, what were you discussing with Fonanya? I think I'm already in love with her. You are what? Just like that? Huh? Hey, 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 yeah. hey! What, what? What are you saying? What do you mean, what am I saying? Have you forgotten we have a deal? What are you trying to do? Are you trying to ruin it? Listen, please, I beg you, Koye. Don't ruin this. Listen, at the end of the day, when this whole thing is over, you can marry whoever you want to marry. You can fall in love whoever you want to fall in love as fast as you want to fall in love. I don't care. But right now, you have to be in character. You're my man. Do you understand? I understand, my princess. But, you know, the thought of her is already in my head. Oh, Jesus. Just thinking. Okoye, Okoye, listen to me. Listen and listen go. I don't want you to ruin this. You gave me your word. Have you forgotten you gave me your word? You told me you're going to help me retain this royalty. And I appreciate it. And I believe you're a man of your word. So you have to keep to your word and be in character. Because right now you're my man. Do you understand? I'm sorry, madam. I must oh, uh, yes, my princess. Could you please, please, don't ruin this. Okay. Mama. Mama, I'm very hungry. Mama, I'm hungry. I'm hungry. <laughs> what are you talking about? You did not cook the food I asked you to cook. Mama, I'm tired. I don't have one single strength like this. I'm tired and I'm very hungry. Oh, you are tired. You don't have strength and you are very hungry. Eh? So the three cups of beans and rice I asked you to cook, you did not cook it because you are tired. Man, there is no water in this house like this and you didn't expect me to cook on an empty stomach. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Very hungry. 
Why will you cook on an empty stomach and kitchen black on our no? Oh, 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 so, you want me to go and fresh water for you, cook for you, in Kegabuli, Ili, Ili, I don't, Kelechi, I can, I can make you know you're sitting there, I'm talking about what's this I'm talking about sitting in Napoala, eh? In fact, as it is now, when I'm done with what I'm doing inside, I'll go to my friend's place, eat there and relax. Ah, Mama, Mama, you cannot do something like that. Me, I'm hungry. Me, 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 I'm hungry. I'll follow you anywhere you're going to. You want you, you want you, you want you. Try me. Mommy, I'll follow you. Anyway, you're going to today, me, I'll follow you. I think you want if you try it, eh? I will disfigure you. Oh, I'm so sorry about that. Even your uncle seized my phone then. Please, I want you to come to your maternal home. We have something very important to discuss. Eh. Okay, I'll be waiting. Okay, take care. Ah, uh, Akuna. No. Oh, uh, my mama. Thank you, ma. Adam, my welcome. Thank you. What's the deal? How is everything? Now? Fine. <laughs> hey, I never go. Hmm. Did you go? Adam, ma. Hmm. Um. Ah ah. Hey. Oh, give me some medicine. What is the matter? What is this now? Kelechi. What is this now? Why are you following me? I thought I told you to go back. What are you doing here? Get for. What is it? Ne, you don't want to Can I take cook now? I say mumba. Fresh water. Eh eh. Fresh fresh wood. Mm mm. Okay, cook. Let us eat. That doesn't have strength. That is. Can you imagine? No. Ne, as it is, I am tired. I came to your house to see if you cook. Let me eat and relax in your house. And she's here with me. Okay, they can make it. Mama, me I will eat. To me, I'm hungry. I'm hungry. Enough, Paul. I'm talking. I sit in there. Let's go. Go and cook food for your mother. You said you don't have strength. Where is your strength? A young girl like you. Can I be kegidi? Where did you keep your strength? I don't blame you. Why will I blame you? I will blame myself now. I will blame myself. I spoiled you. I didn't allow you to do anything. That is why you're misbehaving. Let's record your chakra maka. Oh no, could never, could never, could never, 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 never. You know what I mean? Can you just imagine? Why are you following me now? Eh, go home and cook and eat now. Leave me alone. Akuna, you see it? I told you. I told you, but you wouldn't listen. Uh, 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 Gobiko. Uh, Gobiko. You have seen it. It's okay now. It's okay. Eh? Are you? Are you? What are you still doing here? Have you seen it? Eh? What are you still doing here? Go now. Okay, so if you marry tomorrow, I think I'll go to your husband's house with you. I will not. Uh -uh. I will not. Look, look at that. I'll check on Maka. Anybody that sees you think you have seen a beautiful girl, don't do it now. Cut on. Come, come with the iPad. You can't even cook. Eh? You can't even cook food for us to eat. You let's go in Nazo. You can't even eat that. But can't even eat that. Kelechi, you are telling me. You are telling me. See, from Nanya has a look with a man. I don't mind if you do so. Just look at a man and a look with him. Let me have rest. Don't you complain. Have me. Don't complain. Eh, let's go. Let's go. From Nanya will cook. Let's go. From Nanya will fetch water. From Nanya will wash her clothes. From Nanya we sweep compound. From Nanya, from Nanya we even wash her clothes. Uh, get a mess, Have yeah. you seen it? Uh, it's okay she now. She cannot do anything. Uh, I've heard you. She's up from now, princess. Neka. That is what Neka. she is. Neka. Neka. We go, go. I don't want trouble. If you have to go give me, let me eat too. Yeah? I'm not talking to me, but I will kill you. Come and give me food. Nah, me, I'm hungry. It's okay. It's okay. Let's go inside. Let me go and give you food. Ona. I'll... Go and cook! Ona! Ona now! Ona! Go and cook food! Mama, what fuck is you? Mba, I don't want to go and cook food. I don't want to go and cook food. You are still coming back. Go and cook food! I am... I am going to go and cook food. I am going to go and cook food. I am going to go and cook You are hungry. Oh, come, let me cook food. In fact, they are going to go. Come. They are going to go now. Come and suck breast. Kelechi! They are going to go. Kelechi! Anybody that sees a man that sees now, you don't have sense. You don't have sense. You just pull a note to man You don't have sense. Nothing is up here. You don't even know book. You don't even know how to do anything. Wash your clothes, Umba. No, no. Nothing. Don't say that. Why wouldn't I say it? She's up on now. Meaning? For now. Your princess. Umba, go home now. Kati. Kati. Kati na. Kati. Kati. Hey, for what is it? Why are you shouting my name? 
Cassie, have you heard anything about my sister? My cousin sister, do you know her whereabouts? <laughs> Kelechi. So you have the mouth to ask me about your sister. Do you need a day like this to come? Hmm? Tell me, are you missing her? No relation, really sure, but something like that. May thunder from above. May I wear any way from above? Stretch, stretch that your mouth. Are you okay? Cause is it me you're talking to like that? Are you asking me? Who are you? Kelechi, who are you? Or see me is it me you're talking to like that? It's beg your jibo on you. You made me lose a good friend in Fumnanya. You're there asking me if you're the one I'm talking to like that. Or Jugo. Ew. Cassie. Cassie. You're just insulting me. Remember you're wearing my clothes, oh. I gave you that clothes, Cassie. You wear me. So why are you insulting me like this? And so what? If you gave me the clothes, can you wear me? Come and take it now. Kelechi, come and take the clothes. Or better still use mic and tell everybody in the village that you gave me clothes. Hey, you're not happy that I'm that I'm wearing the clothes you wore. Ew. See. Zelma is not this village. Stay far away from me from this in this village. Okay, Nanya, stay far away from me in this village. If not, I will kill you. Let's bet. Idiot. Cassie. Cassie, you are insulting me. You are putting on my sip so. I gave you that slippers and I gave you that clothes you're putting on. Cassie, you're insulting me. No problem. No wahala. Cassie, I gave you clothes, I gave you slippers, you're insulting. No problem. Cassie! <laughs> no problem. No wahala. Hmm. Okay. So that was how it all happened. I was a retired lecturer. Then I decided to find greener pastures outside the country. Just a few years. I was called that the ancestors, the gods, have chosen me to lead my people. Yeah. I must tell you, I wasn't a good lecturer. I had my flowers with female students. I think that's why the girls are punishing me with this illness. Are you a good man? Oh, no one is. No one is good. Uh, not even the poor. I don't know why I quickly developed this bond with you as if I've known you for a long time. I will tell you the truth. No man is taking my crown. But you need to fight alongside with her. That is, if you want to be a man. Yes. I just like you. I like you too, Your Majesty. You see, no one visits me here except the owner and a man like you. So tell me. But I need to know more about you. So tell me more about you. Okay, Your Majesty. First of all, I want to thank you for accepting me in this place. 
for your real treatment. I really do appreciate. Your Majesty, I... I lost my parents when I was a child. Firstly, my father. After then, my mother. Then my uncle took me along with him and later pushed me away. Hold on. My, my uncle pushed me away out of my father's house. Hold on. How would your father's brothers reject you? They, they, they accused my mother and them. Um, Pushed her away. Accused her of infidelity. That is the only part of the story that I know. Then you have to invite your mother's brother, your maternal uncle, to my palace. I think he holds lots of information about you. Okay, Your Majesty. Oh no! I want to let you know that time is ticking. I have a man. Mother, I have accepted to marry William Spokoye. That is not on your mind. He is going to be my husband, Chief Oji Sa, Godfather. Your plans to take my father's crown will not work. So rest, old man. My daughter has spoken. Where is she going to? <laughs> Look at him. Ah! He can't be the name of Sonia. Oh no. I am so happy now. Can you see? I very soon I'm going to be a mother-in-law. I ah! thank you. Thank you. Adam and Mia. Mamma Oh Malicha. Hey. Oh, thank you, my darling daughter. Thank you. Thank you, mother. Hey, Jesus, my princess, please, I am begging you. Please do not send me away. Please, I have nowhere else to go to. Please. My man is already attracted to you. <laughs> hmm? Okay, I'm, I'm going to make a promise to you. Anytime he's around, I will, I will, I will not come out. But please don't send me back to my auntie's house, please. She's going to kill me. This girl, this girl. <laughs> what would you have me do? Huh? What would you have me do? Because you are about to ruin my plans. If I allow this to happen, you are going to ruin something very important to me. So I am asking, what would you have me do? Okay. Um, let me walk for, for the queen. Well, take me anywhere, but don't, don't take me home. I like, like it here. I am lively here. I don't want to go home. Please, I'm taking you. I swear. <laughs> Anytime he's around, I will not come out. I will not even speak to him. I promise. <laughs> Please don't send me home. <laughs> Are you trying to say? Eh? 
now that our daughter has accepted to marry. That young man's history is still not clear to me. I hope this has nothing to do with his family. I do not want my daughter to step into a family that has faulty foundation. Father, what exactly are you saying? What are you saying? Adora. Yes, Father. Why am I seeing deception in your eyes? Hey! Adora, now I know that your father is a big problem, just like you. Eh? Can you imagine this? Do you know how many years we have begged her to marry? And now that she has agreed, look at what you're saying. Eh? What is really going on here? Father, eh? Father, please, ah. please, I don't want to get frustrated. Please. Adora. Yes, Father. You have your company back. Everything has returned to normal. So you not get frustrated. Oh, no, but because you want to get married to succeed me as the queen of this kingdom to make mistakes. You know what? Suit yourself. Mm. Father. Can we talk as daughter and father? What is it? What are your concerns? My Dora. Yes, I don't see you getting married to that young man. His history is unclear to me. So, you need to find out more about him. Father, I have known this man for a very long time. And you know me, I'm a very good judge of character. And I'm telling you that before I said yes to this man, I know exactly the man I am getting married to. Please. But you don't know his history, his background. My daughter. Yes, father. It is my responsibility, this part of time now, to protect you as my daughter. And I appreciate it, father. You are my only child. I don't want you to suffer in the hand of any ungrateful soul. So, please, don't rush into a relationship till I'm done. Yes, for my findings. I I heard you, Father. Mm. Mm. He is very agitated. My father might be an old man, but he is full of wisdom. And he's very smart. He's a king, so he can do less of himself. Or you think he's I'm thinking the same thing. Yes. I don't know why he said he's sensing deception. That he feels something is off. And why he feels that way is what I don't know. So we have to be very careful. I 
cannot afford to let things go south. Do you understand? I saw you discussing with Fumnaya. That is going to be another problem. Because I can see you have fallen for the young maiden in my father's palace. But do I need to remind you that we have a deal and you have to keep your own side of the bargain? Hmm? You know, I never knew I'll fall in love again. That young girl has been on my mind. And what is that supposed to mean? You think I don't see what you're doing here? Indirectly telling me I need to fall in love again. Is that what you're trying to do? Okoye, okay, I need to remind you that I am still your boss. And you have to mind your business, except you want to lose your original job. I'm sorry, boss. I hear you. Please, can I go with the car? Why do you want to go with the car? To where? I, I want to go and see my uncle. Like I said, you have to see this deal through. I don't want anything going wrong. You cannot ruin it for me. Do you understand? And when this is all over, you can marry anybody you want, any maiden you want. I don't care. Okay? Yes, boss. Mm -hmm. I hear you. Um. <laughs> <laughs> You can go with the car. Up. Okay. <laughs> Princess, for real, I will switch the real feelings for Okoye. Yes. Man, that guy is hot. Have you seen him? The guy is a sweet guy. Handsome. For me, I'm just saying. Lizzie, you're crazy. You are crazy in your head. Uh -uh. In the head. Hard breath, join up. <laughs> this girl. Eh? Oh, God. This girl is mad. This is a mad girl. How did I meet you? No, how did I meet you in the first place? You, <laughs> but I'm still your friend, hey. regardless. <laughs> ah. But honestly, she's making a point here. Yeah, I mean, do you know that when I saw him in the palace, I could not even recognize him as the Tezib driver. You guys are really a match, you know. Anyway, girls, if, truthfully, if I'm to say, if I'm to truly say how and what I want, if I am being honest to myself, do you know who I would have preferred? No, tell us. Well, I, I would have preferred Talk now. Uh, uh, we are your friends. Talk. Say um, it out. You know what? Uh, let it be. Princess, we are your friends. Girls, just let it be. I mean, the person in question has moved on. So it's like um, trying to just let it be. As a matter of fact, I can never say to it, Okoye. No, it can never happen. Whatever I have with Okoye is a deal. And a deal is a deal. And that's it. Period. So just forget it. Oh, the guy is hot though. Hey, Jesus, I have suffered. Hey, Jesus, this beautiful daughter you have created has suffered. I humbled myself. Miss Sonia humbled myself. Franka, we brought our ego down, our pride. Went to the princess's house to apologize for our wrongdoing. I knew she's not a good person. Honey, she's a good person, Franca. She would say, Oh, don't worry, my friends. Don't worry, just come inside. 
the worst sort of it is that Lizzie and Co had the F1 tray. The F1 tray put me shit for face. Tell me make a come up for here. Me, me, Sonia. And the princess couldn't even compromise us. Old friends. Hey, oh yeah, don't worry. I've listened to you guys. Everything is okay now. Come inside. Fuck, can you imagine? Sonia, will you just shut your mouth? Just shut up! All these things happening to us are all your fault. Now see, the house that I suffered to rent is about to be used to rear animals. Sonia! And it is because of this you're too much talk. Oh no, the one that pains me most. Hey, I have lost a dear friend. The princess is no more my friend again because I listened to you. Ah, Sonia, yeah, you're, not, you're not a good Franka, person. Franka, just shut up. What do you, you mean I'm not a good person? person. Ah. Don't even try it. Don't even think of it to put all the blames on me. What do you mean? Now, let me ask you a question. If I tell you to hug a moving trailer, will you hug it? Shut up, If I, I tell you to fall inside where, will you fall inside where? You are here trying to put all the blames on me. When you never wanted to accommodate her in the first place. Look what at you. What do you mean? I know so. How? I know. You never, you never wanted to accommodate the princess. How? Franca, say the truth. You never wanted to accommodate her in the first place. You're a terrible person. You are a terrible person too. You're a terrible person. I don't blame you. I don't even blame all of you. How do you mean my boyfriend is not acting up? Will all of you have the audacity? The F wanted to insult me. And I don't even I don't even have enough money on me. If not, I'll go and lodge myself in the hotel. Be, 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 my be, 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 shut up. See this one. Who gave you money to even rent a hotel? You just go about carrying fake news. Hey, the princess father is a froster, he's on the news, he's this, he's that, he's ah, Sonia. You see, now the mom has given her back the company. The company has been given back to her. Where are we? On the streets, begging for where to put her heads. Wait. Are you okay now? Shut up and stop shouting. Are you okay now? Ah, big mouth. Wait, wait, uh, Franca. Franca. Don't Franca me, don't go. Wait now, let me ask you. You, if I saw you in my dream, you, you were dressed like a, a priest and you said to me that I'm the chosen one. And I loved you Im Im immediately. immediately. I fell in love with you. You know, kiss it on my brother. I said I should always believe in my dreams. But these dreams, this one is unsure. From Nanya. The beauty of the sun. Your name is beautiful, so believe in your name. Fumnaya. Fumnaya. Hi. Are you okay? I'm Why fine. did you check like that? I'm fine. You Kizito, your cousin brother, is here to see you. Really? Yes. Where is he? Follow me. Okay. okay. Are you sure you're fine? Yes, I'm fine. Let's go. Come on. Look at you. Look at you. How are you? I'm good. I'm fine. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm fine. Look, look at your dress. I like it. Thank you. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. How are you? Okay. I missed you. I missed you too. <laughs> I like the dress. I like thank it. You. it. Looks smart and you know sharp. <laughs> um, Kizzy, yes. please before you leave. Let me know, okay? I have something special for you. <coughs> oh, okay. All yes. right. Thank you so um, much. Naya. Hmm. See you later. <laughs> All right. Okay. Please wait for me, okay? All right. What was that? Uh, it's actually uh, nothing. I didn't tell you. What? Choma left me. Yeah, two months ago. Mm -hmm. She... She left me. She said I wasn't good for her. And You're she... joking, brother. Why would I joke with a thing like that? Choma left me two months ago. She said I wasn't good for her. She, she preferred Yahoo Boys then. Mm. About her, mm -hmm. I... 
I don't want to rush things. We're just taking it slow and steady. I actually came to the palace to finish the palace. Uh, the, the site? Out. Yes, the site. Let's see. Yes. Mm -hmm. It's a lie. Kizito, I am not lying. I am telling you what I saw and what is happening here. <laughs> Wait. The man, the same man you saw in your dream. The same man <laughs> is getting married to the princess of this kingdom. I dreamt about him this afternoon before my colleague came to call me. <laughs> and what happened you you told me about the princess? She doesn't like me. She said she, she's not comfortable with me around. That the guy is attracted to me. I don't know. She has stopped me from cleaning the guest room. She stopped me from entering the palace. The palo. Some places. She stopped me. What do I do? Kizito, my brother, I promised that I'm going to stay away from, from the guy, never to come out any, any time he's around. And that's exactly what I'm going to do because I do not want to lose my job. You know how you got this job for me? You see this place? This place is peace for me. This place is love mm. for me. See, everything here, I love it. And I don't want to lose it. So I will stay away from him. I promised myself that to stay away. From Naya. Kizito. There's something about this palace. I, I can't wrap my head around it yet, but there's something about this palace. And I strongly believe something good will come out of it. For sure. But you must stay away from that man. Hmm. Please, oh, Pico. You don't need to tell me. I've already told myself that. This food is nice. It tastes nice. You like it? I love it. So tell me, how is Mama and Kelechi? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Those ones. <laughs> they just cannot stop asking after you. So they can miss you that much. <laughs> and I know why they are asking after you. It's because they have, they have no bones to do work in the house. But trust me, I will never spill. I know you will never spill. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, and Mama, Mama Uchenna is asking after you too. Why? What for? He said there is this man that is coming for your hand in marriage. I guess he's that her husband's nephew. Because you know, I am not interested really. Just tell her. This job is all that matters to me right now. I just want to just walk and... Don't take it serious. Forget about it. They will be alright last night. <laughs> Please drink water. Thank you. Thank you. Forget that man. I know. Please. Do you want some? Are you done eating? Yes, it's. I hope you like the food. I love the food. It's delicious. Thank you. I knew you would like it. <laughs> <laughs> She's actually the best cook here. Please don't mind her. She's just exaggerating. Well, our exaggerations are in place because this food is totally nice. It's tasty. Wow. <laughs> so when is will you come visiting? I mean, your sister. Oh my God, somebody is madly in love with my cousin brother. <sighs> Please stop. We are just friends. Can't friends ask questions? Ask your questions, madam. <laughs> <laughs> I have your number. I'll call you, right? Okay. Yes, I'll let you know. All right. Thank Please you. Do, okay? Sure, I will. I will. Uh, I promise. Let me just let me get this place. It's okay. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm slow and steady. No, she's uh, yes. my friend. Yes, I am. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my goodness. Well done. So when are you going back to the site? Uh, right now. Okay. Thanks for coming. Move. <laughs> Move. You call her, you have a number. Move! Have mercy on me, O oh God, according to thy steadfast love, according to thy abundant mercy, 
blot out my transgressions. Wash me thoroughly from my iniquities and cleanse me from my sins. For I know my transgressions and my sins is ever Rubbish. If I did not look at the man, I would be doing this rubbish. I go one. Now, you may be Oh, why, Macali, I be here. Oh, Mamma, Mamma Zular, Nebiano, I come. Come now, eh? Why, Mamma? Why be fair? Ne come, oh. Oh, Mamma, sir, Nebiacane. Biacane. No. Emilia. Ha! No more you me. What is it? What is it? Ha! I thought you said you would not go to the borehole and fetch water. You didn't say anything that will help you. Mama, don't talk to me in this house. Oh, oh. Don't talk to me in this house. Oh. Just tell your own. Let me stay on my own. Once I use that water and wash all my clothes, I'm going back to school. And I will not come back. I will remain here. I will not come back. Hey, Mama, Mia. You see that water? You will not use to wash your clothes. You will go four times to that borehole and fetch water. Your brother is coming back today and I need water to cook food for him. If you try it, hey, try it, and if you try it. Mama, I will not try it. Mama, I will not try it. You expect me to trek to that borehole again, eh? You cannot even imagine the way people were looking at me when I carried that gallon on my head like this. Everybody was looking at me. Mama, I will not do it. I will not do it. You will not do it. Up for now, you will not do it. Eh, you would have used Jiwago to go and carry the water and come, or better still, open borehole in this house. Eh, wanya? If you try me, eh? If I see your hand in that water, eh, wanya? That's what I will do to you. Mommy, I'm not going anywhere. I'm, I'm talking, not going you're still talking. In a parlor. I'm not, I'm not, I'm going to use this water. You must fetch that know. water. Okay, familiar. You should see, eh? You Mommy, must. I'm not going anywhere. Eh? You will fetch it, oh? Amelia, you will fetch If I see your hand in this water, if I see. God, if I. Oh, it is my work now. It is my work with Alamos. There's no detergent in this house. I was even thinking I, I can actually find one inside. Ah, I I have to trek down to that store and go and buy detergent. Me, after washing this clothes, I'll leave this house for good. I'll leave this house. Eh? Me, I'm tired of all these things. Keleti fetch water. Keleti cook. Keleti wash plates. Keleti clean house. From Naya, from Naya, hey, me, I'll leave this house. So, I'll leave this house for good. Ha, check on. Oh, this one girl on one could there. She's. Chapol, are you sure there's water in this gallon? Eh? Are you sure there's water in this drawer? Eh, what are you? No water in this drawer. So now we're to run Millie. Eh? Chakom. No water in this drone, and she wants to use this one, this only gallon that she fetched and wash clothes. Eh? Oh, my men on now. What will I use it and cook for my son that is coming back today? She wants to use this water and wash her nonsense clothes. Muka the Mary University girl. In the, in the university. She must go and fetch water. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Who took my water now? Nah? Who took my Who took my water? Mama? Ma Mama? Mama? Mama, did you take my water? Mama? Mama?
knock this door. They're looking for my job in this house. Anyway, I know where you are. I'm coming to meet you. You must provide my water. You must provide my water today. You must provide my water. You must provide my water today, Mama. How are you, Your Majesty? I am not getting any better. My wife is telling me that you are after my head. What is my offense to you, my very good friend to forge you? May the gods forbid that I will request for your head. You are my friend. Not just my friend, you are my brother. <laughs> Brother, indeed. Brother, come. Woman, keep quiet. Why do you want to provoke the gods? You want to wear my crown on this your ugly head. Is it your bed, right? Your Majesty. You are a man of wisdom. Insult me the way you like. I am under your honor and jurisdiction. Our tradition made it clear that if the king does not have a successor, any man from the kingdom can step in and take over the throne so long as he has the interest of the people at heart. I will succeed my father. I am going to be queen. Hey. Adamu. Mm. Did you tell your father that you want to marry? A taxi driver. What? what? What are you talking about? Your Majesty, I have done my findings. And I know exactly what I'm talking about. Hey! Chief OJ! Huh! ye Williams is an oil mogul, businessman extraordinary. Hey! So now you have resorted to peddling rumors. You want to sit on the throne, but you have lost it. Yes, he was once a taxi driver, but not anymore. Your taxi driver. Adora, how could you? By the way, how long have you been in the business of letting out taxes to people? It's not up to two years. Wait, did you lie to us? You lied to us. I know it. Hi. When I want to get information, I know where and when to get it. Hmm. I still want more. Father, I like this man. I like him. Doesn't matter what he does. All men in the world, you chose a taxi driver. Your taxi driver. A man who remits money into your account. Ha! You lied to us. He even lied to your family. Mom, does he look like a taxi driver? The first day he walked into this palace, did you see him as a taxi driver? It doesn't matter. I don't know why this is an issue. A taxi driver will never marry my daughter. 
over my dead body. Father, after he has engaged me and everybody knows about the wedding, is your plan to disgrace me? You might as well tell me to go and stand on the road and get hit by a lorry or something. Because this is not making sense. Mom, you have been the one on my neck choking me down to get married. Now I have a man. What do you have to say about it? Yes, he used to be a taxi man. And I changed him. I, I, I pushed him up to my taste. You didn't even know he was a taxi man. Not until you did your findings and found out he was one. So what's, what's the difference? <sighs> you are not yet telling us the truth. I don't like that young man again. He has broken my heart. Father, you two are frustrating me. No, this is, this is becoming a deliberate act. You two are frustrating me. What do you want me to do? No, really, what do you want me to do? Adora. Mm. Majesty, please take it easy, okay? You know Chifoji is haunting the palace. Mm. Eh? Pico. I don't care. Hey! Hey! Ne. Kedeti will not kill me before my time. Yeah? She will not kill me because I did not kill my mother. I will, I will stay here. Yeah, let you stay near for Zweike. Can you imagine that girl? She went to the borehole. First, just one gallon of water. Of a gallon. I want to use it and wash her nonsense clothes. You should do that. Which one will I use and cook for my son that is almost on his way back? Oma Mekwa. Akonuna. You and Kelechi, your daughter, won't allow me to rest. Supposing I'm not living in this village, what will you do? I'm not going to be here. Don't go anywhere because I will follow you. This is what I'm Aga. Hey, let me ask. Were you able to get um, uh, uh, from Naya's well about from my son? He doesn't talk to me, he doesn't tell me anything. Eh? I know he's the only one that knows where from Naya is and the man she's staying with in Ogwage. That boy is hard hardened though. Oh, very, very hardened. Oh, yeah, he can never tell me anything. Hmm? Akuna, all your own is man, man. Fumnaya is working somewhere far away from our kingdom. Eh? Yes. In fact, she works in a palace. Kizito told me after I begged and persuaded him to tell me. He told me how you people want to kill that poor innocent girl with Sofa. And I supported him to take her out. Are you serious? Yes. My son told you. Yes. Hey. Mama. Hey. Mama, where is my water? Mama, where is my water? Okay, the kind of water. Keleti, what is it? Keleti, you will not wash pakam in that house until you go to that bowl, fresh water, oh. and fill that drum in my room. Imelia, in fact, for men used to do it. Now she has gone. Okay, so you will do it, Mama. I'd rather die here and now than go to that bottle to go and fetch water. I will not do it. Okay, you will die. Kelechi, why won't you fetch water? Mama will not fetch water. I will not do it. Hey. 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 Are you expecting someone? No. Sebika. Anyway. Whoever it is. To see the Hey! Oh, go and come!
Okoye, just wait. Njaki, go back. Do you mean that you are going to get married to the princess of Ezudo Kingdom? <laughs> yes, Uncle. Hey, congratulations, Uncle. Hey, 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 please. Mba. Open your bag, Biko. I told me in here. Woman, what do you mean by that? There's a girl I told you that I want you to get married to. Her name is Funanya. From what? She's very beautiful. I like her. Yeah. yeah. What are you saying? Eh? I you so Eh? Was it because I was calling her all sort of name when she was here? Can be sick, Amma. How are you better than her? You that cannot cook. You cannot wash clothes. You cannot even bet yourself. Don't just tell me how you're better than from Naya. Mama, Mama. So you're supporting from Naya to marry that kind of rich man I saw today. Me that is Aso Dogo. Mama, I am Aso Dogo. Mama, I am neat. I am classy. I am educated. Mama, I am prayer point to my boy. Kai! You that cannot wash your pants. That cannot even bet yourself. It's like you can go off, Mama. If I don't walk in a liquid seal, I want to know if from now was one doing your first assignment when she was here. It's a bully boy, so we will quit a bully boy. Don't fool yourself. I'm not seeing my mistakes. I will pamper you. A letter on a letter. I will pamper you. No, it took half a year. Get like Ali. They sing Kapu Kapu Na Pai Ali. I know of ya. But you call him. God can bless someone. Just imagine. From taxi driver to a millionaire. Ah, hi! And you now want to marry a princess. Ma, my mother princess must be very beautiful. Hi. And the man is handsome. Ah! Mama, I'll follow you. I'll follow you to that introduction. Oh, I yeah. must go with you. I may or may not go. I'm a bem. I'm a bem. So, I don't know. Mama? Hey, hey, hey! hey. Jidia, avoid me. <coughs> Call him. Tell him. Don't mama me. So you have the guts to take from Nanya to far away kingdom to go and work in a palace without telling me your mother, without taking permission from me, knowing very well that she's the one that does all the chores in this house. Yeah. What? Kizito. Kizito. So all this while you knew where from Nanya was? Uh-huh. Yes, now. Hey! Of course now. Yes, I know. Is that the reason for this gang up against me? Is it? I know where from Naya is now. No, I come in here. I can. Mama. I can. Mama. You will not use my water to cook palm for Kizito. Kizito must starve in this house. In this house like this, Kizito will starve. It's a good way. I say, it's a sad. It will not happen. My only son starve in this house. Makagewa. I say. My only son. <laughs> now. But I go, yeah. let me help you. Huh? Nam. Mama. Let me help you. You know it's my water and what? Na be kaiba. Mama, mama. So you na, prefer Kizito na, mama? Mama, how are you? Uh, I'm fine. Oh, na mo. E pata go. How was the walk? Mama. <laughs> what kind of a mother is this? Two seconds she was so angry at Kizito. No, 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 no. She's now sweet with Kizito. What kind of a mother is this one? Tomorrow she will support me. Next tomorrow she will support Kizito. Three minutes now she will start supporting for Naya. Ha! God forbid. God forbid. I heard you are getting married. Yes. I I am sorry I kept it away from you. It's okay. There is no problem. Eric. Yes. I don't know what to say. Just say you love me, but you don't want to be with me. It, is it okay if we are cool? Because I really like you 
I hate. Just give it up already. You have feelings for this guy and you know it. It is written all over your face. Come on. Zina, you will not understand. Understand what? Understand what? Understand the fact that I cannot trust any man. I can't. Not after what Michael did to me. I can't bring myself to trust any man again. But you know all men are not Michael. You need to heal. Come on. You think I don't want to heal? Sina, I want to. I want to. I want to be able to heal. But I don't know how to. See, I'm like that child who is seriously sick. But doesn't want to take medication. Does not want to take injection. Does not want to take drugs to get better. But wants to get better. Naturally, if there is anything like that. Well, you can't. I, I, I just can't bring myself to heal. I don't know how. But you can't keep waiting. You can't. The world is moving. And you can't just stop moving because of a man that broke your heart. Come on, my princess. You can't. Zina, thank you. No, really, thank you, because I know you are just looking out for your friend. Anything for you, my princess. But I will have to go ahead with the plan with Okoye. Hmm. As you wish. Anything for you. Thank you for understanding. Thank you, my princess. Anything for you. I'm here for you, my princess. You're the best. Thank you. <laughs> oh, God. Did you say you don't want anything? No, don't bother. If I want anything, I will let you know now. See, I nearly commit suicide when I think say, I don't lose this job. I swear. <laughs> I don't even know mm. Madame go reclaim this house back. <sighs> my dear, mm -hmm. you don't know what's going on. See, my think I tell you, I no one know. I don't want to know what's in the world. You see this gate? Mm. That be my business. Mm. Anytime a person come, knock, or even do pa pa pa, I go just go there, open gate, ask him, oh God, who you? Who are you? Mm. Who you define? That be my own, no? <laughs> Midway, mm -hmm. wait, mm. are they here, see? I don't hear, I don't talk, um. You don't hear what? You never have, mm, wait, make I talk with you, I won't talk, you don't hear, um. what will be that? See? I know what make you talk um, because me yourself don't hear her. And uh, I see now, uh, I know one come to discuss Madame for this afternoon, eh? Hi. So thank hey. you. Eh. Hey. So Madame go even dream of marrying that driver, that Mr. Koye driver. Eh? That man will carry us that day. Hey. Holy Money on my mind, money, money. I beg, come on for you, eh? Mugu. You've not changed from your old ways of being a bad boy. <laughs> You're a bad king. <laughs> You're a 419 king. <laughs> Very bad boy. So, tell me, what was your findings? Um, about the young man. Well, uh, it is true that the young man lost his parents at a very tender age. And uh, he is still single, he's not married. But he trained a young lady he intended to spend the rest of his life with. But the lady later absconded with her boyfriend. But there is even a, an interesting angle to all this. Fire on, fire on. I need to be in the palace because it's almost time for my medication. Um, Your Majesty, you need to relax. Take it easy. You'll get every information. 
Oh, he better need to be certain. That is why I asked him to get his uncle. Why I get more information from you. Mm, that's right. You see, my wife doesn't know that I play games. She thought shutting down my father's house account and closing down the company will make her uh, get down. Uh, uh, it was, uh, I believe, it has contributed. But if not for your intervention, at least coming for my crown, she wouldn't have a, a seat up. Mm -hmm. but, Your Majesty, you endangered my life. Uh, I can't wait to see the surprises on the faces of your family. By the time they know that everything is a prank. Especially my wife, who almost insulted light out of my dear friend. <laughs> <laughs> you know, she was even ready to hire assassins against me. But, um, Your Majesty, I want you to look, at, uh, you know, have a second look at that young man. The boy is a hard-working boy, and I like the boy. Um, that boy, don't look at his profession and write him off based on his profession, you know? Forgive them and allow them to get married. Oji, oh, you're my good friend. This illness is gradually taking me. And I think I need to stop to allow my daughter to continue from where I stopped. Your Majesty, don't be foolish. Uh, it is not time for you to die yet. You are going nowhere. We have not finished our games. We need to play more games. You know, as we used to play it when we were in lecturers. <laughs> you know? Oh, why do you hate to respect me? Remember, I made you a chief. And you don't want to respect me. <laughs> Your Majesty. to be on my way to the palace. Hmm? Okay. It's okay. Uh, send me word to your family. Okay. It's okay. Thank you very much. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, this food is sweet though. Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay. As it is there, uh, you take me to where from Naya is working, you know, to the palace where she is. Mama I won't. Why? She's my niece. She's also my cousin sister, my only cousin. Eh, Kizito, how much are they paying from Naya? 80,000 naira. Hey. Jesus. And they will increase it by next month. Ah. With fitting account and accommodation. And rest of mind, Mama. And rest of mind. Away from your bullying, chastisement, frustrations, depressions. Ah, ah, I only make a note from Naya now, Mama. Eh? Away from your constant pushing her to go and fetch water morning, afternoon, night. I'm my sorry, boy. I'll get it. So, Mama, if you enter from Naya's room. Don't touch me now. Talk if you now. enter from Naya's room, Mama. Ebony, then I drew AC. Hey! From Naya is in heaven, no? So, so what we're talking now is that teaching a girl what she's supposed to do is now a punishment, okay? 
Mm -hmm. As the saying goes, charity begins at home. But your own charity started in from Naya's body. Leaving this lazy girl that don't know how to do. She knows nothing. She don't know how to cook, clean, even wash her own clothes. All she does is wear from Naya's clothes. You take me to that palace where she's working this weekend. I can't be suffering and I have someone who is working there. And receiving such amount of money. And I'll be here suffering. Oh my mekwau, you take me to where she is this weekend. Else, I will arrest you for forcefully taking someone that is under me. Mm. So then, I am ready when you are, Mama. Uh, ah. Brother, <laughs> is there still vacancy at the palace? There's vacancy, my dear sister. But not for you. Mm? Because you are lazy. You know, eh, the palace. There's this thing about the palace. It's only excellent people that work there. And you're not excellent. And tell me what is excellent about you now. Nothing. You don't know how to do anything. You can't cook. You can't clean. One day, you can't even fetch common water to drink, let alone to wash your clothes. But who told you I cannot wash? Who told you I cannot wash plates? I cannot cook? Who told you? Don't I live in this house? It's obvious now. Hmm? Mama. So don't worry. Okay. There is the one that told him I don't know how to do all these things. What kind of thing is this one now? In Elin, sir. He's your brother, he lives in this house. He knows what is happening. I'm an ebar rulu, ni bezi. Like, you can't even take care of yourself. You want to go work in the palace, on your ala. Dirty girl. I'm not going to go there. I'm going to go there now. Any day you decide to change your character, hmm? work on your attitude, mm -hmm. and then go back to the palace and consider... Work on which attitude? Me, I want to work on. You see, that's part of the attitude. Now, Kizito, you are insulting me. You are insulting me. You insulted me. How did I insult you, Mama? You took for Naya. To the palace. What happened to your own sister? Your own sister, flesh and blood. What happened to me? Mama, it's your candy, Abama. You kill it because. I'm just, you know, Mama. People should stay and complain about from now. Yeah, I carry the food and go now. Carry the food and go. Hey, this boy is wicked. Very wicked. Mwa boni ubi apu. Very heartless. Shut up, mucho no easy. Stay here, very heartless. You cannot do anything for yourself. You can't cook, you can't wash, you can't even wash your own clothes. Easy. Nice and careful, I'm Don't stop. Hey, shut up, because that's our princess. Let me think, because. Get out now, let me think now. I was told you. Mama, Papa, Mama, Papa, get here now. Get out, also, so let me think. <laughs> oh, sweetheart. <laughs> I can't wait. Yes, I can't wait for tomorrow. Oh, you're, oh no, you're going to come with the Ogenis. No, you are going to come with the Ogenis. <laughs> Everybody will be there, yeah. of course. <laughs> oh, that's serious. That's serious. <laughs> it's all right. It's all right. <laughs> of course, I can't. I can't wait to be your wife. Mm -hmm. I love you too. I love you more. More, 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 more. <laughs> Babes, I have to go now, okay? Oh. Of course we will. Mm -hmm. If I go to bed. Yeah. Bye. Don't miss me too much. Don't miss me too much. <laughs> Oh my God! <laughs> Your happiness is contagious. <laughs> yes, mom, it is. It is, mom. I am so happy. I am so, so happy. <laughs> and, uh, mom, where is my taxi? <laughs> what are you doing with that rickety car? Mm? Huh? You should look for someone and give it to dash it out. Maybe to Onowu or anybody. <laughs> you don't stress yourself with all these businesses. Mm. You know, Mom, when this whole thing is over, you owe me an apology. Yes, you do, Mom. You do for all the things you've put me through. Do you know the kind of stress you've dragged me through? You owe me. You owe me an apology. I, your mother. Yes, mom. Should apologize to Of you. course, mom. You Adora. owe me a big apology when this wedding is over. 
apologize to you. Mm. Adora, are you smoking something? <laughs> As expected. <laughs> As expected. Why are all African mothers the same? No, mom, I was expecting you would at least disappoint me. <laughs> Adora, I humbled you to bring out the best in you. Look at you, making long calls, love calls. So, since morning you've been on this call. You, I <sighs> thought you were rigid. Now look at you. <laughs> you should have allowed the Chifoji to take over your throne. <laughs> I owe you apology. My Mom, God. speaking of Chief Oji, hmm, that man is another problem hmm. that needs to be taken care of. I tell you. That man is a project on his own, but I will take care of him after this wedding. Pull him out from the company. I don't care if he has the largest share. Mm -mm. Mom, that's not the best way to go about it. Pulling him out of the company will affect us. Yes, it's going to affect us. Mm. But like I said, he's a project. And I will take care of him when the time is right. Mm? I trust you. Don't worry. Don't you know the daughter you have? I trust you. Just I leave know. it to me. I know. I know but mom, please don't coming. forget. You're giving me my taxi today. Ah. Thank you. Mm. I'll see you later. Let me... <laughs> See what they have for me. You people are welcome. Thank you Thank very you. much. You are welcome. We are here to inform you people that your son is getting married. Mm. Yes. Which of our son is that? Because uh, as far as I'm concerned, we don't have any other blood brothers apart from Enanna. Uh, 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 mm. uh, okay. Why is it that both of you are pretending as if you don't know who I'm referring to? Okay. You are late brother got married to my late sister called Florence, and both of them had only one child called Okoye. You mean you don't know Okoye? We don't know him. Don't come here and make us look like fools. Eh? You think we have forgotten? You think we have forgotten that you gave your late sister to our late brother to marry? Mm. Don't make us look like fools. Eh? Let him go and marry. I don't even know why you have come here to come and tell us about this matter. How does it concern us? Is your blood son? Is your son? Why you not come here to come and tell us he's getting married? How is it our business, uh, 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 Ichi Mark? Now I understand that both of you are evil men. Mm -hmm. That's why you kill your brother because of greed. Ah, you send Okoye to me to take care of at a very tender age, huh? And then in the end, you want to collect every landed property that belongs to him. Mm. Hmm? You killed him. Yes. Don't make me tell you what you wouldn't like to hear. Don't. It's a mark. Mm. I told you that we shouldn't come, you shouldn't have come to this village in the first place. But you said you wanted to fulfill all righteousness. It is obvious. We are not welcomed, and they would not come. Let us go. If you want to go, because he just said, made a statement now. If you want to go, you can go. We are not asking you to stay. You know what? We all need to look our very best. As for me, eh? I want to look extremely beautiful. Fumlaya, please. Please, you help me and make my head, please. Ah. See this one, oh. so you want to look more beautiful than the princess, huh? You are See, just, just stop joking. I really can't okay. wait. I've anticipated this day a long time ago. Mm. And guess what, girls? I asked Kizito, my man, to come to the palace tomorrow. <laughs> you and this your new boyfriend. Let us breed. Ah uh ah. -uh. Let the single ladies in this palace breed. Ha. Huh. Please, Nico, oh, I need to announce yeah. this. I am not choking anyone in this palace. Love is just taking me to where I don't know. Simple. <laughs> Fumnanya, you're not saying anything. Talk to us. What is your problem? We are your friends. I'm okay. 
Sorry, you. Sorry. Maiden of the Queen, Queen of the Ladies. Your Majesty, so how did the meeting with the minister go? Fine. Just fine. Yes. <laughs> okay. Your Majesty, see, my husband, we need to disassociate ourselves from Chief Oji. That man is a chameleon. Ah, I have known Tifuji for many years now. He's not a chameleon. <laughs> Why? He's not a chameleon. Then tell me, what will you call a man that will laugh in your front and then go behind you to kill you? If you see the chaos he caused in this palace today, let me tell you, he wants to overthrow you at all costs. And you're telling me he's not a chameleon. Mm. Ah. Oh. Woman, please. Can you allow me to at least rest? Anytime I bring up this topic, this is how you always do. Can you allow me rest? Haven't you rested enough? I am telling you that something bad is about to happen to our own kingdom. Your throne. In this... Rest. That is all you want. Problem. But don't... <laughs> want to rest. Keep resting. Until it is too late. Mama, hey, Mama, oh. mm. when is the time for the traditional marriage? Uh, that should be later in the day, but as it is, I am sure that the men are still with the Igwe. For me, the traditional right. Oh, perfect. Mama, please help me select. Help me select the perfect outfits for this particular traditional marriage. To wear? To the traditional marriage, of course, now. Were you invited? Ah. Ibu friend in there. In invited me and not you. So why would you go there? Mama, Inne is your friend. For the fact she invited you for the occasion, that means I'm automatically invited. So I'll be there. Don't worry. I'm I'll be there. There. You want to go there uninvited? Kijeli free food. Okay? If I see you there, eh, I will disgrace you. You want to go and disgrace yourself. <laughs> Mama, with or without you, I will be there. In fact, as I'm talking to you right now, I am already seeing myself inside that place. Mama will be there. <laughs> You don't have sense. With or without me, you will be there. As. Eh? As what now? Kelechi, I don't want to see you there. Mama, I don't want to see you there. Mama, don't worry. Don't just worry. I know the perfect outfit to rock. <laughs> you will see body there. You will see your body there. You will see me there. Hot body is coming. <laughs> hot body is coming. Hot Mama, body hot body is coming. This is shameless. Ew! Hello! You, professor! Mba, I cannot walk. Never, I will never, never walk. Mba! 
His, his face looks familiar. I think then, I know him. Okay, my son. Please tell me, do you have any kind of knowledge of the princess? What is the matter? Why are you causing nuisance here? Mark, Mark, you won't succeed. You will not disrupt this event for us. You won't. Never. Tell me the truth. Like, like what? I don't understand. What are you talking about? Have you led with her? We can give yes and we can make her work in our mind. Excuse you. I don't understand. What is going on here? What's this all about? Uncle, Uncle, can we sit to our side, please? You're embarrassing everybody here. She's a princess. I've not even seen her underwear. I've not. Igwe, don't you know me? I command you to speak as you can see. Old age has caught up with me. Good. This marriage cannot hold. Uh, How uh, dare you? Uh, Is this man mad? Okay. This man is your biological father. What? No. What is this? Prof, don't you know Florence, my sister? You are a student at the university that you pregnanted and ran away. <laughs> Flores. Uh, yes, brother. You've been vomiting since you came back from school. What's the problem? Brother. Whether it's malaria. Malaria? It's, I've been battling with it from school. Sorry. They need to run a test to know if there's any other healing. Okay, Don't brother. worry, you'll be fine, okay? Okay, brother. Your soda, let me get money, okay? I'm coming. Family. You have brought disgrace to me. I'm disappointed in you, Florence. I will kill you. You go to me today, Come here. Come here. Come here. Oh, Florence. My wife is sister. Now she's pregnant. I sent you to school. You didn't get pregnant in, 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 during your secondary school days. But now the university. After all money I have spent on you. All the effort wasted. You are not ashamed of yourself. Spread your legs. Now the, you, you, have, you have been known as the, as, as, as the prophet. Oh my goodness. Please, my husband. I'm begging you on her behalf. Please forgive her. She's deeply sorry. She has been crying all this while. Please, you need to forgive her. She refused coming home thinking you are going to kill her. <laughs> Please, my husband, Biko, forgive her. It's been two weeks now. Please, my husband, find a place to forgive her. Please. Brother, please, I'm sorry. Brother, I'm sorry. I know I've broken your heart. I know I've disappointed you, but please. Please, brother, forgive me. 
<laughs> Remember, I'm your only sister. Your only Lord, please. Please do not hurt me. Please. You need to forgive her. She's your only sister. Please, my husband. She told me everything. And she's deeply sorry inside of her. She said he's a lecturer. Not even a student. Please, my husband. Be gone now. I suggest you go to her school. Maybe with your friend. See the lecturer and talk to him. Tell him what he has done to Florence. Be cool now. Oh, the mama. Lord. Please. Please, my husband. Please. Please. Biko. <laughs> Professor Onoha ran away from Nigeria to be with his fiancée after giving us fake address to his house. <laughs> I can't forget that. I don't want to think about it. I wanted to kill him in his office that day. You had me back. Okoro, you cost everything. <sighs> Do you want to go to jail? How can you kill a man in his own office? How can you do that? Each time I wake up to see my sister in that condition, I feel very bad. My heart is broken. I feel like doing something crazy. I am not happy. Then you should accept Ichi Agumba's proposal. How do you mean? That I should give my pregnant sister out to a man old enough to be her father? Ichi Agumba is not that old. And you know it. Um, my brother, for your sanity, I will just tell you this. You have to give You your want to marry my sister in such condition? Which man will accept her like that? Knowing fully where there is another mouth child in a womb. Um, Ichi Agumba has declared interest in her. So you should give her to him. Let them marry. See, listen, let me tell you. I wouldn't want you to regret it tomorrow. You know how our society thinks. You will not say because of she's having another man's child. For that, there will be a time no man will want to marry her. So, left for me, I will say you should go for Ichi Agumba. I heard Ma Zi Okeze and Ichi Agumba are coming for a hand in marriage. For me, oh, I will go for Ichi Agumba. Yes, because he is rich. He is very rich. He has lands and cattle. And I'm very sure that he will take very good care of your sister. Just think about it. Eh? I have accepted the advice given to me by my friend called Okoru. Thus, I gave my sister's hand to Agumba to marry. Unfortunately, she died during her second child's birth. As a matter of fact, she died with the baby. You see, Okoye, professor here is your biological father. You cannot marry his daughter because both of you share the same blood from him. Traditionally, Okoye is our son. Of course, shut up. Shut that your dirty rotten mouth if you don't have anything to say. Of course, I think you should keep quiet because I know what you want to say now. And that thing you want to say is no longer necessary, especially at this point. So I advise you sit down and keep quiet. What I know about him, is that the mother was seven months pregnant when she was giving out a marriage. What a world. Oh, I know Florence very well. She was a brilliant law student that year. I 
I can't believe this. Are you saying Okoye is my brother? Ah, what a world indeed. What a world indeed. Anyway, this was all fake. Eh? Fake? Yes. I, we had to come up with a plan. Me, Okoye, my friends and I, we had to do something. I, I had to do something. I had to save my father's crown from leaving the lineage. I didn't want it to leave my father's lineage. So I had to come up with a plan, coupled with the pressure coming from my mom, from everybody. So we came up with this plan. I don't have any feelings for Okoye. We don't have any feelings for each other. We just wanted to play along and get everyone off my tail and move on with our lives. Hence this plan, which turns out to be a plan of the gods. Because if this hadn't happened, I wouldn't have known that Okoye is my brother. I would have married my brother. Father, this is so, this is so disappointing. How could you have left a pregnant girl at your prime? How could you have abandoned her? Now I would have married my brother if this was not fake. I would have married my stepbrother, have children with him and, oh my God, I don't even want to say it. It's sounding so disgusting. Igor, why? Why, why did you do this to me? And to my mother? Why? I am so sorry, son. I am very sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I was confused. I was in total disarray that I have to leave the country, the university. I ran to pitch tent with my friend, Chief Oji, here to prepare my visa for immediate exit out of this country. So there I got my visa I left the country to London. I'm so sorry. Now I can see that you can't fool the gods. Once again, son, I'm sorry. Atache, Ulohi Bongole. Atache, Ulohi Bongole. Igwe, Professor Pascal Onoha. Your crime during your youth have resurfaced. Wise one, what must I do? Atache! Ulohi Bongole! Atache! Ulohi Bongole! You must crown your son the king of this kingdom in the next AK Market day. For the gods to be pleased with your spirit and your soul when you join your ancestors. I am ready to crown my son. I'm ready to give him my kingdom. I'm ready. At least I am happy now that I have a son that will succeed me. I'm ready to give all for him. Thanks to the gods. Well, I've been in talk with her. 
mischief, orgy, and uh, we're all planning together all this while. Your Majesty. What His Majesty said, what he meant, was that I had no intention of taking the crown from the family. It's just because of the lackadaisical attitude of the princess towards marriage that made me to come up with a plan with His Majesty to provide a force that we compel her to be serious in finding a man. That was what happened. All that he said is absolute truth, right? There is no time Igwe Professor Pasca honor her. The gods want you to crown your biological son in the next Eke Market day. Else, your entire family will face the wrath of the gods. What wise one? He cannot be crowned king without a wife. There must be a queen. Things cannot just change drastically before our very eyes. Otunya bine nyamake, kotunya bine nyamake, kotule bi ane yenya. You must provide a girl of your choice that will be crowned alongside with you on a key market day. I'll choose from Nanya. This is for you, for all of that I cost you, all the pains that I cost you. Please forgive me. I'm sorry. My king, five million naira for me, only me. No, I can't take it. It's too much. Honestly speaking, I am forgiving you. Moreover, we are now one family. Yeah, so I don't need this. Please. Mark, please. Take it. It's nothing. Take it. You see, I cost you pain. I did so much wrong to you. If Florence were to be alive, her existence, what's more than money? Please, don't reject it. My king, I have already forgiven you like I said before. It is said that one can never reject any gift from the king. Thus, I have no option but to accept it. Thank you very much. I remain loyal. Very cool. Oh. Look, Ndaka, no matter how you look at it, Okoye is our son. It was our late brother who married the mother, and that makes him our son. Eh? Leave that thing. Leave that thing that you're talking about. Traditional, you, you are right. But we rejected the boy when his father died. We're all bowing at her feet. Even you, Mama, I saw you. And you, Mweke feeling funky. I saw you. I saw the two of you buried at her feet, trying to claim relationship where you built none. Mama, each you get I'm telling you, she's now in the place of rest, freedom. Am I to talk about the 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 the, the, the bloggers and the television stations? Everything we're just, you know, on her, taking pictures. 
taking interviews, making all sort of videos. When I pull an hour and now, hey, Jesus. Is it or she's my sister? Your sister. From Naya is my cousin sister. Mama, and I'm happy for her. Are we not happy for her? Very soon I'll go to the palace and stay with her. Oh my, my, my shut up. Shut up. Won't keep him. Shut up, nya, 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 nya. go to the palace and stay with her. Who will take you to the palace? Who? Me? No, now. Kizu, I'm sure you... Fumnaya will not invite you. Kizu, I don't understand. Why are you talking to me like this? Fumnaya is your cousin sister the same way she is my cousin sister. Since when? Ah. Ochako Maka. Since when did Fumnaya become your cousin sister? Eh, eh, eh. Kizu, don't go. Ozugo, I don't want that. You are mocking me, insulting and laughing at me. I am still your mother. I am still. I can't believe you. Mama, nobody said you are not my mother. Of course, you will still be my mother. But I for from Nanya. I don't know why, ma. From Nanya is in the place of rest, and nobody can stop it. Oh, you thought from Nanya's career or destiny would just die like that? No, now I should have known. You see, from Nanya, eh? Kai, oh, he did her head. <laughs> That is my sister. Very soon, I'll go to the palace and stay with her. Ah! Yeah, from Naya. Yes, very you soon, I get to the Chinese and stay with her. Who is this one? Who is this one? Who is this, one? Who is this dirty thing? You will go where? See, prepare and go back to school. Okay, Naya, go and pack your things and go back to school because I intend going there to stay with her. I talk about nonsense in there, man. Mama, if you, Mama. you want to go and stay there with her? Uh -huh. She's my niece. My late sister's daughter. And I am her mother. I need to go to the palace. Stay with her. Teach her things. How to make her marriage work. Yes. And how to manage her home. So I should be a good mother in the future. God, are you not wonderful? What God cannot do does That's not exist. Come on, me If for you, what God cannot do can exist. And it will exist. Because you, you have no remedy. Your bad character has eaten deep in you because you're about poor. Kizito, oh, Mama. if you like it or not, I am going to the palace. I'm going to the palace oh, oh, oh. to see from my own sister, my very own sister. Hey! Mama, I'm going to the palace. I'm going to the palace. Break it. Go and kill them with smell there. Go and see both of the palace. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> Mama Kizito <laughs> My darling sister Kelechi <laughs> Well I just want to say a big thank you for attending my traditional marriage I mean I was Ooh. so surprised at the same time happy to see you Thank you for coming Thank you so much. Thank you. Um, again, Mama, I I came here to let you know that no matter what, me from Nanya, I am still part and parcel of the family. That's why I came. Okay. Hey. Oh, from Naya. My name is Hi. Ne. Forgive me. We in Naya is a small place. Ne mbanga. For the way I treated you when you were here, I am so so sorry. And thank God for still remembering me. I am still your mother. Oh. Of course, you are my mother. I am still your you mother. You are my mother. <laughs> so thank God for still remembering me, your mother. And still seeing me as part of your family. I appreciate. Thank you, Mama. Thank you, Mama. <laughs> <laughs> Sister from Naya. Sister from Naya, I'm very sorry. I'm sorry for everything. I did to you. I'm sorry for being so rude. I'm sorry for disrespecting you. I promise to be a better person. I will respect you. I won't do anything to hurt you. And I will equally respect others. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's 
nothing. It's okay. <laughs> Thank you, from Naya. Thank you so much. And uh, first of all, I I still want to add to what Mama said. I am, you know, happy at what she said and what Kelechi said too. Thank God they realized their mistakes and they've apologized. And from Naya, I want to appeal on their behalf to please forgive them. Look, I am so happy for the kind of man you married. He's amazing. Oh, Jesus, you don't need to tell me. <laughs> he has done so much for you. And you coming here today, he also sent one of these uh, palace drivers to drive you down. God, I'm so happy. <laughs> Is it a, just say no more? Mm? Say no more. I, do, I don't want us to be going back and forth. I, do, I don't want it. Because if I have not forgiven them, I, I won't have been here. That's why I'm here to tell them that I have forgiven them. It's, it's okay. All right? She's still my mother. And she's my precious sister. <laughs> oh, well. Uh, okay. I brought you all a little gift. Kizito. You're the man of the house. This is um, 100,000. Eh? Just hold on to this. Do one or two with it. I don't know. Hey. Sweet. What <laughs> Mama, hmm? this is for you. This is 100,000. Hey. Mama, don't, don't, hey, don't start. Don't start. Hey. 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 Fum. Fum, Mama. Mama, sweet sister. Where's sweet sister? Sweet sister. Here. This is hundred thousand. Ah. You know you're in school now. You need to buy your soap. I need yeah. to buy some of it. It's okay. This okay. is uh, Mama. Okay. <laughs> it's very little, Mama. Please, anytime you need anything, don't hesitate to to to, to call me. Let me know how to. I will. I will. Okay. From Naya, Mama. From now, you need to collect 50, 50,000 from their money and give to me. They, what? You what? give them 50, 50,000, right. they give me 200,000 now. Mommy, I'm in school, I'm in school. I need things as a bad I need things. Mama! Mama! Mama, can we I am sorry, I didn't speak your calls when you were calling. I actually didn't know it was ringing. I was very busy at my father's company. And also, I had to show my brother around the company, introduce him to people and all that. So I was caught up in the moment and I forgot. It's okay. Congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. You have a brother? Oh, I do. I, I do. I mean, I, di I didn't even know he existed. Not until... You. Uh, Princess, I... it's okay. That is how the gods want it to be. By the way, I, I will guess. be leaving the country tomorrow. I am going back to the United States. I just stopped to see you for the last time. Oh. so much. I, I am sorry I bottled it up all this while. But I do truly love you. Princess, I love you more. What is it you've been staring at me since you came here? What? What is it? From Nanya. What? Is this you? Can see this is me. Hey! Please, may I touch you? Cassie, you can even hug me if you want. Come here. Hug you. Come on. Oh. <laughs> Naya, please. Ah. I'm sorry. No, 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 no. Stop, stop. Please. 
Cassie, get up. <laughs> please forgive me. Please forgive me. Cassie, stop, stop. Please get up. Just get up. Why? Why were you kneeling down before me? See, from Nanya, I've heard too many times. Please, I'm not ready to be your friend. Forgive me, please. <laughs> please. Cassie, come on. Don't do it. Don't do it. Stop. I'm not God. Why are you kneeling before me? I'm so ashamed of myself. Listen, Dumpy. I forgave you a long time ago. I hope nothing against you again. Honestly, I, I don't. I heard you came. So I said to come and see my friend. You did well. You did come. 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 <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Ujungwa, is this you? <laughs> yes. Wow. Flesh and blood. <laughs> <laughs> I heard about your coronation. It spread abroad. Wow. So you were a prince all this while. I <laughs> see, uh, the gods used my uncle to reveal it to me. I'm now mm. a king. Yes. As you can see. Yeah. <laughs> so how have you been? It's been a long time. And your husband? It's been long we met. Life is meaningless. My ex-husband divorced me four years ago. We are no longer together. I have two kids for him. Mm. So what really happened? He got fed up with the marriage. So that was what happened. Mm. Anyway, I'm sorry for the way I treated you in the past. Please forgive me. That's okay. I've forgiven you a long time ago, long, long time ago. I don't even have any grudge here at all. You know, like you said, you are my past, so I can't even recall anything of the past. I'm sorry again. I wish you can take me back. I wish you can give me the chance to make it up to you. I don't mind being the second wife, third, fourth, and even the fifth. Ujungwa. Ujungwa can never be a party to one thing. You know, um, the Bible says something. And I love that in that particular verse. You know, for a man to be with one wife, one body, one soul. You see, I, 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 I can never be a polygamous king. No, it's not in my bloodstream. I'm sorry about that. I love my wife. From Nanya, I love her. I am sorry about that. Okay. Yeah. So how is life? How is everything? Ujungwa, <sighs> you, 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 you look good. Yes, your stepbrother is fine. He is doing great. So how is your husband, Eric? Okay. <laughs> ah, your father wants you people to come back. He wants to see you and your husband. You know, his sickness has taken a turn for worse. It's getting worse by the day. And he has refused medical treatments. 
Your stepbrother wanted to fly him abroad, but he refused. Yes, you know your father. He wants to see his family. Madam, madam, you are just four months pregnant. Four months only. You can't hop into a flight and come down to Nigeria here. What will it take you? Just do it. Okay. Your father wants to see you. Okay. All right. See you when you come. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, greet Eric for me, okay? All right. We'll be expecting you. Okay. Till then, till when you come, okay? All right. Uh, I will tell your stepbrother. I will tell him. All right. Uh, greet your husband for me, please. Till we see you guys. All right. Bye. My children. Father. May the gods of my ancestors bless you. I see. Oh. Oh. May they guide you. I see. Oh. They will protect you. you see. They will shield you from all enemies. You see. Uh, my children. Father. I don't think I can make it. Father, come on. Don't say that. Don't say it. You will make it. You will come out of this strong. Okay? Nothing will happen to you. Father, nothing will happen to you. We, your children, will still need you. Yes, Father. Please. Yes. Just, just try and catch your breath, okay? My daughter. Father. May the gods grant you and from Nanya, save delivery. You see. see. There's always a time for everything. A time to be born and a time to go back to the Creator. Father, nothing will happen to you. Nothing. Oh. Ah. My son. Father, may your reign never in your trouble. The gods of my ancestors will grant you wisdom. Just be courageous. Be courageous. To be ready to remain the right hand of this kingdom. The entire kingdom is looking up to you. 
God bless you this day. You see? So, the gods will not abandon you. You, you see? see? The gods will not abandon you. You see? So, the gods will not abandon you. The Father, Father, you go. What happened? Eh? What give me? You go. Father, Father. Father, 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 please come back. Father, 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 come back. Father, don't do this. This, 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 this is not the plan. This wasn't the plan. It wasn't part of the plan. Dike, Dike, don't do this now, Dike. Namo, Namo, do something. Do something. Are you not the king? Don't go back, go back, go go. Don't go. You hear me? Can you do something? Can you do something? Are you not the equal? Do something. Hey! Hey! This was not part of the plan. This was not part of the plan. This is it. 